Jane is a partner at Umbrella Family Law, where they work with family law clients to help them start their new lives with dignity and respect. As a long-time step-parent, Jane personally understands the twists and the turns of the post-separation journey and has watched children adapting to new arrangements. As well as being a lawyer, Jane has a graduate diploma in counselling and enjoys working empathetically with her clients to help them start their new life. She's also a qualified parenting coordinator. So, Jane, do you have slides? I do, but I'm going to do some talking before I put them up. Well, hello, everybody, and thank you, Karen, for the opportunity to be here among beautiful friends uh, virtually tonight. My name is Jane Libbets. My business is Umbrella Family Law, and my passion is positively transforming people's lives post-separation. Warren spoke about fear of the unknown and fear of loss. I was really excited by that because those are the things, of course, that my clients are dealing with the minute they walk through my door, whether it's real or whether it's virtual. So imagine that you or someone close to you has separated. It's not hard to imagine. Probably a lot of you have done it, and inevitably you'll all know somebody who has. It happens to lots of people. Now imagine that person walks through the door of many, many, many lawyers, many of my colleagues, for whom... Uh, life as a litigator is their passion. They love the cut and thrust of being in court and going for the jugular. We think that that's not such a great way to be, although this is an exciting time to be talking about change because as of the 1st of September, that's tomorrow, the courts are merging and we're getting new rules and people like us who are mediators and lovers and not fighters have been able to persuade the government that maybe it's a good idea to have to do some mediation before you go to court these days. So it'd be interesting to follow that change and see what my fellow litigious colleagues do with that. But imagine that they've gotten through the mediation with a lawyer who doesn't really care much about it and says, eh, just jump this hurdle, let's get you to It meant that overnight we went from seeing his children two nights a fortnight to suddenly having them live with us all the time because that's what can happen in court. You can go in expecting one thing and come out and find another. So all of these things are why, in our practice, we strive to keep people out of the court system and we're part of the brand of new lawyers who like to do things a bit differently. And if people need to litigate, we give them the extra care and compassion and acknowledge that it impacts their lives far beyond the legal ramifications that flow into the very core of their identity. Karen, can we please hit my slide? So at Umbrella Family Law, we help people to, who are separating to start their new lives by helping to deal with the legal, practical, emotional and financial issues that arise. Because we know that it's not just about law, it's about everything else that flows on from that. We do that often by collaborative practice, which is a beautiful, sensitive, gentle journey where the partners and their lawyers sit down around the table uh, and work often with a financial advisor to, to, to deal with the financial aspects and a psychologist to deal with children's issues. All of the negotiations around the table without name calling, working out what's going to be in the best interest of that family. We provide parenting coordination, which is separate to the lawyer role. This is a fairly new thing in Australia, where what we do is we sit down with a couple post-separation, this is both the, the mum and the dad, to really talk about how to help them parent in a way that's going to be in the best interest of their child. This is for people who've already got orders but need to implement them in a way that doesn't zhuzh up the conflict, which so many people love doing. It's about keeping the conflict down. And importantly in our practice, we like to help people with our Pivotal Life Moments program where we offer them support, referrals and a plan for moving forward with all aspects of their life. Imagine if instead of just wanting to take you through the court process and onto the litigation escalator, imagine if your lawyer actually wanted to help you with your CV. Or imagine if your lawyer wanted to help you start up the Facebook page so that you could get your small business moving post-separation. Imagine a world where actually we all cared about each other and you know what? In Karen's world and here in the YTM room, that's exactly what we all do. So at our firm, our why is to get people out of and off the litigation escalator and to help everybody to resolve their issues post-separation in a way that really reflects and resonates with moving on with their lives in a positive way. Next slide, please, Karen. Or do I do the next slide? Oh, my God, I hate technology. <laughs> so um, I don't know if you can see that, but the planet doesn't need more successful people. The planet desperately needs more peacemakers, healers, restorers, storytellers and lovers of all kinds. At our practice and here, and I would like to throw out to the universe that we all become lovers uh, and not fighters. So, as I always like to say, if you're in pain in the rain, call Jane. We're here to help. Thank you. Wonderful.
Thank you very much. As I say, every year we run this event, I'm glad I'm not a judge.